Once again, we find ourselves in a time of great uncertainty. Here we are in the day after elections, still waiting to hear who actually won. That may even take a few more days. Also, now that we're going back to phase two here in Connecticut, we realize that this pandemic truly is spiking once again. You know, we never really know what any of these things are going to mean for us today or tomorrow, but all we do have is today. And I hope that we can keep our focus on the things that really matter in our life, and certainly in our life as Catholics living in these times. We need to be respectful of one another. You know, the threat of violence following this election is really disturbing. Why would people want to destroy when we have an opportunity perhaps to build up once again? Why do we want to tear down when we can make people stronger? That's true with both this virus, it's true with both this election. Let's use these as opportunities to strengthen ourselves, to strengthen our faith, and to strengthen one another. You know, we are called by Christ to be for others, not for ourselves. And if that's going to take place at any time in our lives, if we're truly going to live that message, these are the days to do that. And so live well, live Christ, find peace and find hope.